Psalm 4. Hear me when I call, O God of my righteousness. You have relieved me in my distress. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. How long, O you sons of men, will you turn my glory to your shame? How long will you love worthlessness and seek falsehood? But know that the Lord has set apart for himself him who is godly. The Lord will hear when I call to him. Be angry and do not sin. Meditate within your heart on your bed and be still. Offer the sacrifices of righteousness and put your trust in the Lord. There are many who say, who will show us any good? Lord, lift up the light of your countenance upon us. You have put gladness in my heart, more than in the season that their grain and wine increased. I will both lie down in peace and sleep. For you alone, O Lord, make me dwell in safety. Our home has an open floor plan with a cathedral ceiling in the foyer. There's a lamp there I turn on each night. It's amazing how it casts its glow throughout the house up and down. If anyone has to get up in the middle of the night, there's no fear of tripping. Yet I forget to turn it off each morning. It's not evident it's still on when the sunlight pours in, drowning it out. This reminds me of how so many of us are with God. When circumstances turn dark, we look to God to light the way. Yet when all is resolved, that holy presence goes unnoticed. Our need isn't as great, so the light gets drowned out by the busyness of life and our own self-sufficiency. What's critical to remember is that although the bulb in the lamp at my house burns out and needs to be replaced, ours is an eternal God whose light never dies. Our goal should be to walk in that light in bad times and in good. Luminous God, open my eyes to your guiding light in bad times and in good. In Jesus' name I pray, amen.